women. It seems eating for two doesn't always mean a healthier diet. So true. Our chief health editor, Dr. Martha Nandy, joins us now with why so many aren't uh, meeting national nutritional guidelines. Oh, no. Yeah, some people may not want to hear that eating for two is not the best. So healthy diet is important for women planning on getting pregnant because the first eight weeks of pregnancy is key for your baby's development. There's a new study discussing this topic. So. Ooh, Doc, I had my midnight fish fillet <laughs> and fries. <laughs> um, but when is a craving and versus how much you eat of bad food, when does that Yeah, and this study talks separate. about this. So this, this new study from the University of Pittsburgh's School of Public Health finds many women are not meeting the nutritional requirements uh, that more than 7,500 uh, pregnant women track what they ate for three months around the time they con conceived. Hispanic, African-American, and less educated women scored the lowest. However, none of the women... In, the, in any racial or socioeconomic group, including white women, achieved the recommended uh, guidelines that, that, are, that are outlined in these in this study. So it, everybody really didn't quite meet the guidelines. So, so what were they eating? I know Glenda said about a fillet of fish, but mm. what were they eating? So fillet of fish. The, <laughs> the researchers found that these women got roughly 34% of their energy from empty calories and processed high-fat, high-sugar foods like uh, sugar-sweetened beverages, pasta dishes, grain desserts. Soda was a favorite for African Americans, Hispanic, and less educated women, while beer, wine, and spirit were the top energy sources for college and graduate degree women. The idea is all of them have the same thing, that they're empty calories. So tell us what we should do. Oh, is that those prescriptions, right? So number one, your body needs high quality foods to pre help prepare for pregnancy. So eat plenty of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean protein, not just protein, but lean protein. Also, make sure you get enough folic acid in your diet as it helps protect the baby mm -hmm. from birth defects, beans, Peas, citrus fruit, spinach and asparagus are great choices. Also, most of your nutrients should come from food, but you can take a prenatal supplement before you get pregnant as it includes key vitamins and minerals your body will need. And lastly, don't smoke, drink alcohol, or use drugs if you're planning to get pregnant because they can be very harmful to your baby's health, especially during the first trimester. So what happens in the first eight weeks of, of pregnancy if we're, and we're almost out of time, but what, what happens if Absolutely. we don't so eat right? We've been talking about this. So first few weeks, first eight weeks, many of the baby's major organs and body systems are beginning to form. Your health and what you eat directly affects your baby's growth and development. So do the right thing, exercise, eat right, limit your foods with added sugars, saturated fats, and very little fish fillets. I'm sorry. <laughs> good advice as right. always. Sure. Thank you, Doc. <laughs> if you have a question yeah. or health concern for the good doctor, you can email him at drnandy at wxyz.com. Send it to us, Facebook, Twitter, we will get it right to him.